Welcome to a glorious beachside path here in a very picturesque part of Catalonia in Spain where my Evolve first generation single engine electric skateboard is my go-to form of transport. I'm now two months into a trip around the world with my family and actually the skateboard has got me around Copenhagen, Amsterdam, Berlin and it's absolutely brilliant here near the beaches in a place called Barra in northern Spain. But of course, this video is a review of the latest GTX from Evolve, which I was lucky enough to test a month before we started our trip around the world. So I'm gonna send you back to East London, to the Olympic Park, where I was given a few hours to play with the crowning glory of several years of R&D at Evolve, the GTX. Well, that's incredible. I mean, the interesting thing is just whacking it into, uh, I don't know if you can get that in focus, into fast mode there, and um, instantly that power comes in. Will, who's filming with me today, is riding my uh, Evolve. This bad boy, even in fast, I'm not in GT, really kicks. Experience tells me that I should take my time down here and not even try the brake, because the brake might, might buck like a mule as well. Very, very smooth. Much smoother than my original Evolve, uh, this GTX. And that's, uh, that's because of those Evolve 97s, Will. Wheels, yeah. yeah. I just blipped the, blip the brake then, look. This is a classic mistake. Just trying, just trying to easily, I'm just trying to very easily apply speed, because if I overdo it, I'll be, I'll be on my back. This is not only a thing of absolute fetishistic beauty, look at it, look at the goldness on it, with that fantastic honeycomb grip tape, and these, these beautiful Evolve 97s, they're called, big, big cruising street trucks. So not only will you get an enormous amount of torque out of this thing, insane acceleration, almost to a point where, well, for me, it's a little too quick in the acceleration stakes. But what makes the GTX distance to the GT is the range. Look at that. This enormous battery has increased the range of this from the GT, which went 20 miles to 30 miles. So you'll get a really good day skating on this thing. It's also very light, you know, as, a, as an owner of an Evolve uh, with a single motor on the back, but a, a much earlier generation of motor, which is almost three times bigger than just one of those things. Um, this is really light, you know, you can carry this between uh, you know, tube stops, on the bus, whatever you need to do, and it's not going to make your, your biceps bulge. I mentioned these motors, look at them, they're extraordinary. 1500 watts each, that's insane. And just the build quality, the workmanship, look at it. Absolutely gorgeous. The other thing about the bamboo deck is of course it gives you a lot of flex. So if you're into longboards, you know, you want those big cruising wheels and wide trucks, but you also want the flex because that's, that's kind of part of the experience. Okay, let me talk you through the controller. There's a safe mode on the controller now. Now that's a really good feature uh, because if you've ever ridden any sort of high performance electric board, you'll know it's easy to flip that, whoops, and fly off and bang your head. Now that wasn't meant to work, it's in safe mode. It's still got some acceleration, it's so slow. Oh right, so this thing is so gnarly, it even works in safe mode. <laughs> but it doesn't work quite as quickly as it does when you hold this finger down. And you're into eco, that's the kind of, that's the mode that you use to go through town, all right, in a way that's safe and respectful to people. Uh, you then move up with another click to fast, and when you've got used to that, uh, when you've, you know, you, you're sort of, terror gland is slightly relaxed and you're, you're getting a bit more used to it that's when you click it into GT which frankly is off the scale bonkers so the only limit to this test really is my ability as an old school skater to have enough courage to really let rip on this GTX. I mean, just look at it. I'm not even touching it. 
go right. I'm not even touching it. I'm really barely servicing this throttle and the speed is just out of the hemisphere quick. I've never experienced anything like this. It's beautifully balanced and it's got that range. So you know, you're not draining the battery. You know, for the sake of some quick thrills and then having to get the, you know, the tube home, you can actually ride out, go to your destination, do some proper riding and get home. enjoyed the review hope that you can uh, log in to my vlogs as me and my family travel the world and i'll be doing loads more gadget and product reviews as always on the channel over the next year oh and don't forget if you enjoyed what you saw today like and subscribe running around like i don't know directions wasting my time with too many reflections yeah and since you've been gone i've been trying to fix me and I'm getting there Yeah, I'm getting there